I'm Dusty, and this is uh, a series that I'm doing called Living in an Extended Stay Hotel. It is for people who have made enough mistakes that they now live in an extended stay motel and need some tips on how to just keep on keeping on. Alright, so uh, on this first part of the series, uh, I'm going to deal with cooking. Uh, we're going to make something tasty. Uh, it's kind of fly by your seat of your pants because like, you've already been doing that enough that you now live in an extended stay hotel. So, uh, let's see. We're going to make some bacon. Uh, got a pan. Uh, you're going to want to turn the oven on, you know, with, with the knob and whatnot. Uh, and now you, you're also going to need to turn this knob, which is a timer that the extended stay hotel has, uh, has uh, installed so you, you don't burn the hotel down because, again, you're probably pretty irresponsible. Uh, also, one of the things I like to do before I start cooking is remove the fire alarm because I don't want it to go off. Uh, okay, that being said, uh, let's see. Uh, I've got some bacon. This this is uh, cruelty enhanced free range pig bacon. Um, you can use. Oh, well, I want to actually oil the pan first. Normally I use butter, but I don't have butter, so I'm using this oil that's in a can that I do have. Um, and then here's my cruelty enhanced uh, free range pig bacon here. And uh, I'm just going to layer the pan with this shit. I've already washed my hands, which you, you, you really need to do if you're handling food or whatever. Uh, and then I've got my, my knife, which I use for just about anything. And uh, so I'm just going to layer the pan with this bacon here. Oh, and I, I cranked the, uh, the oven all the way up too high. And, uh, just gonna distribute the bacon uh, real quick here. Uh, sometimes I'm just gonna go ahead and let two stick together because, you know, fuck it. Uh, you're not really gonna cook it uh, the best that way. Um, I personally do not give a shit, so, you know, it is what it is. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do this and then I'll also add some salt and some pepper and then I'm gonna add some sriracha sauce as well because this is spicy bacon you know your mileage may vary you you, you add what you like uh, so you, you can really add anything to the pot sometimes I just pour a little enchilada sauce in there because you know why not right uh, when in Rome as they say uh, I have recently moved to Texas so it's kind of like Mexico but not at all um, but they do have enchilada sauce at a lot of places. Um, so that's why, you know, whatever you want to do. And I'm just peeling this off and trying to layer it. I'm doing the best job I can, uh, trying not to, uh, you know, get the bacon on other things. So, uh, for the hot sauce, I get the sriracha. So I'm just gonna give it a good coat there, you know. Your mileage may vary, you know, do it to your specifications or whatever. I'm going to go ahead and pinch off a little salt here. Because Lord knows I need a little more salt. Uh, and then i got some pepper over there. I'm just going to go ahead. I'm actually going to uh, go ahead and hit it with the oil again. Kind of disperse a little bit of that sriracha. Get a little even. Whatever. So, uh, and then that's going to that's gonna be nasty and fry and boil. And uh, through the magic of uh, YouTube, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll uh, come back when it's ready. Oh, every time you complete a task, if you live in a hotel, I throw away. By the way, <coughs> whatever, you know what I'm saying. Um, so, uh, you complete a task, take a shot of vodka. Why not, right? I mean, that seems like a good idea. Let's just go ahead and pour you I, I have a decorative skull glass. Um, I'm sure whatever shot glass you have, it's probably pretty similar. Some kind of uh, body part or something. Um, and, yeah. Well, I'm going to take this, and uh, I'll see you when the bacon is a little more cooked. Alright, uh, through the magic of television, uh, my bacon is ready to be flipped. I'm just going to do that with a, a knife. I, I suggest investing in a good one for your hotel stay as uh, you will be using it for everything that you do. Um, 
on the next cooking episode, if I, if I do another cooking one in particular, uh, I'll be cooking steak, and the knife comes in a lot more handy. Um, let's get some of this uh, matted up, fried together bacon. Let me just, you can flip it over. Ah, like a cheat. Or so well. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna go ahead and uh, freshen it up with a little more uh, sriracha. You know, your mileage may vary. Uh, I'll see ya when I see ya. When... So, uh, as you can see, uh, the bacon, uh, it looks, some of it looks burnt, some of it looks overly fatty and undercooked. Uh, that's, that's about how I like it. Ow. Burn myself there. Uh, I gotta go ahead and turn that off. Uh, the, the timer will do its thing, so you don't have to worry about that. Um, and then, uh, what I'm gonna do is, uh, Prepare a sandwich uh, in a second, um, and take this shot. You know, uh, with the drinking, you don't have to drink as much as I do. Uh, you drink more or less. You know, you, you do you. Uh, so, yeah. All right. Uh, moving on. Next step. Okay. So, um, what I've done here is I've cut up uh, the top of a pizza box to use as a plate. Um, got some bread. I'm uh, going to put uh, the bacon on the bread. Hold on, where did my knife go? You can't lose your knife, it's important. Because, uh, like, you're going to use it for everything, like I said. So I'm just going to take one of these little Bernie sheets of bacon here. Just going to apply that directly to the sandwich. Alright. And, um, I probably, uh, I'm going to want some ham, too. Uh, this is what I have, so this is what I'm using. Uh, if you're curious as to an ingredients list, it's really whatever's in your refrigerator. Um, I'm also going to use uh, this uh, cracked pepper with olive oil and mayo. You may use whatever plebeian mayo you have. Um, I'm also going to use this uh, mustard, uh, horseradish uh, mustard. Again, uh, your mileage may vary. Use what you have. You know. Your mistake is yours to make. Can't make it better, make it worse. Uh, just lay that ham right on top of there and uh, get a little mayo here. And. So people like a lot, some people like a little. Uh, I like too much, as always. Um, lifestyle choices were made. Uh, and let's see. Um, ooh, gross. Uh, there we go. Okay. Uh, and I really think that's all. Um, for cooking with Dusty in this. Live in an extended day with Dusty episode. Um, again, your mileage may vary. Um, oh, the bacon grease. Uh, if you leave it out, it'll uh, get solid and that's gross. But it's easy to clean out the next day because um, you can just throw that in the garbage instead of trying to get rid of it through the sink. So, um, or I mean, you just throw it in a bottle and you know save it as lube or whatever uh, you want to do. Um, so, yeah. You figured out, uh, where did my shot go? Um, and enjoy! I will see you uh, in the next part, uh, which will either be cooking steak or, uh, I don't know, um, something fun. <laughs>